So by now, you've probably heard of some ransomware groups. Did you think you had to worry about fake ransomware groups? What the heck is that? So <laughs> let's get into it. Hello everybody, welcome back to Stan's Garage, bringing you everything you need to know for effective business IT management. Today we're gonna to talk about a new trend in cybercrime, fake ransomware groups. Yeah, you heard me. Fake ransomware groups. You're probably saying, Stan, what the heck is the point of a fake ransomware group? Fake ransomware. Well, let's start with what's ransomware. So if you're not familiar with ransomware, it's a type of malware that encrypts your files and demands a ransom to be paid in exchange for the decryption key. In recent year, ransomware attacks have been on the rise and they have become a major threat to businesses of all sizes. Yes, small businesses too, they come for you as well. However, now we're seeing a new twist on this old tactic. So fake ransomware groups are just another variant of cyber criminal who pretend to be a ransomware, but they do not actually have any of your data. They're gonna make empty threats to leak sensitive information if you do not pay the ransom. But in reality, there's no data for them to leak, right? They're just relying on the fear and panic that a ransomware attack can cause to extort money from their victims. It's not that different than like the IRS, fake IRS calls that were prevalent of a couple years ago. But the danger of these fake ransomware groups is that they are much easier to set up and run than a real ransomware op operation for obvious reasons. They're not actually doing anything other than like sending you some emails or other pop-up messages on a compromised website. They don't need to create any sophisticated malware or steal sensitive data. That's a, that's a lot of work. And they can still make a significant profit by targeting vulnerable businesses and individuals. So what should you look out for to avoid falling victim to fake ransomware groups? Well, first, you know, be wary of any unsolicited emails or messages that claim to be from an actual ransomware group. Check your sender's email address and, and make sure that it's uh, legitimate, right? Second, you know, usual stuff. Keep your passwords strong and use password manager and two-factor authentication. Keep that software up to date and uh, some cybersecurity awareness training will go a long ways to spotting real versus fake ransomware. You know, if you have questions, you can partner with a managed IT service provider, uh, you know, one like us that I'm particular to uh, stginfotech.com. MSPs will help you identify potential vulnerabilities in your systems and implement solutions to strengthen your cybersecurity. They'll typically implement monitoring, and we do, the 24 seven SOC available that can monitor and quickly respond to threats, reducing uh, the likelihood of any attack being successful. So to conclude, the rise of fake ransomware groups is a concerning trend that all businesses need to be aware of. It's, it's social engineering at a, at a more base level of all the, the fear that's uh, been brought up around uh, ransomware. So, you know, if you're vigilant in protecting your systems, you can avoid falling victim to these scams. Now, if you're uh, in the market for an MSP or just want to, someone to ping about these kinds of things, you know, feel free to set up an appointment with me via the Calendly link in the show notes. But what do you think? I mean, have you ever come across one of these fake ransomware gangs or maybe a real one? Anyway, hit me in the comments and thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next one. All right, fake ransomware.